Howdy my friends and welcome back to more Let's Play Grand Turismo 4. In the last part we got very, very frustrated at the Grand Canyon. And now we're going to move on to some more rally where hopefully we won't have as much frustration. But uh, Swiss Alps I guess. And this track was also in GT2 and 3 I think so. I think it's the same track anyway. So maybe it won't be too bad rally event where you can enjoy throwing your car around as much as you like all right well i don't know how much i'm gonna enjoy this i wish i could have enjoyed the grand canyon but instead i had to be pissed off uh, oh wow we're racing another celica look at that 49 point race more points than the delta I think that Celica stalk has like 230 horsepower though, which is more than what this has. But we have uh, put some parts under this weight reduction and all of this stuff. Yeah, I don't think this track's gonna be near as bad. That Grand Canyon though, gosh. I don't know why the AI is so good on that track. It really is very frustrating though. Makes me surprised he didn't just fly past me there. It's a wonder, really. As bad as the last race went. Let's just forget about that last race. Okay. It never did. You know, see, this is a relaxing. This is a relaxing rally race here. Why couldn't the last ones have been like that? I mean. I know I'm not the best in the world at rally, but I didn't really think I was that bad. Golly, that last race made me think otherwise. AI oh, yeah, is so ridiculous on Grand Canyon. They really don't want you to win that Ford RS200. I swear, man, they don't want you to win that thing. Speaking of which, I could use that for the for the ice race. So all I need to do is put the the uh, ice tires on, but I don't know if I'll use that or not. I, mean, I could just put the ice tires on this, but I figure y'all, by the time we do all these dirt ones, y'all be tired of seeing this. Okay, well, this is an easy race. Much more relaxing. I'm actually having fun. I mean, it's not super duper easy, you know. I actually have to be careful. But, you know, it's a. Uh, not so ridiculous that I had to drive like freaking crazy in order to even win. I mean, I didn't even... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, man, that Grand Canyon. I just said, let's uh, forget that it ever happened and I keep talking about it. The rage is still real, though. The rage is still so real. Golly, I did not expect to dominate like I'm doing. Over 13 seconds, wow. Didn't even touch the nitro. <laughs> 49 points. You can tell I'm not really overpowered. I mean, it's 49 points, so. Not overpowered, just. Actually drove better than the computer. <laughs> Which brings me back to my point. Why did, how do they drive so good on the Grand Canyon but not on any other races? Uh, why is that a thing? 
shouldn't be a thing. Well, that's a pretty little view there. <laughs> I remember expecting him to pass me there. Didn't happen, no. Didn't happen. All right, move on to the next one here. Ooh, that Grand Canyon! Gosh, can't get over it. Just can't get over it. I swear, it's a thing. It's a thing, 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 thing. Uh, Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution Three. Oh, cool! A different car. 93 point race, oh gosh. Apparently this is gonna be much tougher. Well that Lancer definitely has more power, has more power than the Silicade. I don't know how much it's tuned. Well, really, you're gonna run into me right at the start. Well that actually kinda of hurts you. Not that I really care, you know, about your well being or anything. Oh, oh, okay, here, here we go, here we go. This is how I expected the last race to go. Sliding out. Just slowing me down. Ninety-three points, man. I don't know this track is good backwards either. It seems like it's tougher backwards for whatever reason. Oh my gosh. Oh man. What's up with the last race being so easy and this one being... I mean, I know it's more points, but why is the Lancer that much better? It's really not much more powerful. That's like 15 more horsepower, unless it's tuned up more or something. There's no consistency. That was a pretty good pass. Wow, he's actually decently far back there now. But he's probably gaining on me very vigorously. Okay, quit sliding all the way out. Turn. Actually, actually. Oh my god. No, no. Okay, and then we're, we're going out again, so yeah. That's not boating wheel for us. Turn, please. Where, are, where is he? He's right on me. Oh, there he is. I don't like it when I can't see him. Unless he's just way, way back there. Okay, what am I doing? I don't know what this is. Go, 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 go. Okay, we got this, I think. Hallelujah. You know, this actually was a fun race. It was more doable. And it was m much more ice bake points than the freaking Grand Canyon race. But it was doable. It was a challenge, but doable. I 
I love how it hit me there at the start. That was great. Like it already had something against me, man. had something against me. Whew. All right. Well, that's down. Probably a pretty short video, but you know. Enjoy. Enjoy a break for me. Oh, man. I tell you what. As this project goes on, the videos will get longer. Indeed. Mitsubishi CZ3 Tarmac. It's like a cool looking little car. It says it's a Tarmac vehicle. But, you know, I'm sure it would be good for off-road as well. Alright, so I guess next time we'll probably do Tahiti. Oh, Tahiti, I remember it. And then we got Cathedral Rocks. Fort forwarding. Well, two different types of Cathedral Rocks. Which actually blends onto the El Capitan raceway, I think. Alright. So, where's our dilly that we just won? 230 horsepower, so. Hmm. 1200 kilograms, so not very heavy. How's that compared to our Celica? 211 horsepower and. 12, 28 kilograms, so the CZ3 actually is better, apparently. All right, y'all, well, we're going to stop right here, so thank y'all very much for watching. Join me next time where we will get dirty again. <laughs> Hope to see y'all there. It's been Sky Hurricane. Have a super awesome, blessed day, and as always, stay awesome. Goodbye, y'all.